this is a controversial topic which is should RNA be discontinued when the left ventricular function improves. We for some unexplainable reason find that patients have a weak ejection fraction for a long time and once their remodeling is adjusted with RNA, ejection fractions get better. They go about 35, 40, 50 percent. Now, although I don't have evidence for this, but we find that when patients reduce RNA, they have a tendency to go back into the, the low ejection fraction category. Now we have evidence that RNA can be used irrespective of ejection fraction. Low ejection fraction, moderately reduced ejection fraction between 40 and 50, or preserved ejection fraction above 50%. In all subsets, if we can use RNA, there is no reason to discontinue RNA if the ejection fraction improves. So as long as the patient tolerates it, my recommendation would be don't stop this wonderful drug because very often do we come across uh, such lovely drugs in today's day and age which can show such outstanding outcomes for heart failure patients. So let's offer the best possible to all our heart failure patients in terms of medical management.